be recognized. Well, speaking of internet safety, California passed a historic law to protect consumers online. But the law only applies in California. However, it may soon affect North Dakota and the entire country. As Washington correspondent Alexandra Limon reports, lawmakers are racing against the clock to pass a federal law to prevent a patchwork of state laws. Washington Senator Maria Cantwell is working to craft a federal online privacy bill. Deeply sometimes personal information is shared and that that information can be used to be targeted or to exclude consumers. Republican lawmakers and companies like Walmart that do business online also want a federal law to avoid a patchwork of individual state laws they say could overcomplicate things like buying gifts online. She lives in New Jersey. I purchased it on Walmart.com using my cell phone with a 516 New York area code. I live in Maryland. Which state law applies to that transaction? California's new Consumer Privacy Act takes effect January 1st, but it could take other states years to pass their own laws, leaving many people unprotected. But on the federal level, Democrats and Republicans have competing bills. Mississippi Republican Senator Roger Wicker says both proposals are an improvement. Are much stronger than the California law. But the differences in the proposals could make or break the outcome including whether to allow states to update laws as needed, how strong civil rights protections will be to prevent discrimination, and whether people will have the right to sue for online violations of privacy. The consumers are entitled to clear and concise explanations of how the services they use are collecting and using their data. South Dakota Senator John Thune emphasized only a bipartisan solution has a chance of becoming law. In Washington, Alexandra Limon. Well, a new report suggests that